immigrants always shy away from high-profile functions with U.S. government officials, but this time in the state of Massachusetts, they had a day of honor and esteem as the governor, Debell Patrick, acknowledged and gave them the audience they have been yelling for for years. On April 24, 2010, Africans braved the chilly weather as they converged from all corners of the state of Massachusetts to the Tobin Community Hall in the city of Boston where Deval Patrick held the first of the kind forum with immigrants who had a chance to meet with the reigning governor and speak out issues of their concern. The stage was a little different for the governor, who was danced rather than walked into the hall full of immigrants from all 52 countries in Africa to kick off his campaign among the largely ignored block of voters. During the town hall meeting, participants grabbed every opportunity to take a photo with the governor, leading to a scramble for the chance. So I'm glad today to have you here with us. There was a light moment as the governor counter-responded and announced a slip of tongue to avoid a breach of protocol. We are fortunate to have Governor Patrick and President Deval Patrick. Uh -oh. I mean, uh, President Barack Obama. Despite the, uh, the misspeaking during the introduction about, uh, did you say president? Yeah. yeah. The governor endeared himself to the immigrants when he called out a total of 14 African countries that he had visited and worked. Wait, wait a minute. How many of you are from Egypt? Ethiopia. Who's here from Nigeria? Who's here from Ghana? Those are all the countries in Africa I have been to or lived in. It was unfortunate that when it came to question time, many of the participants directed federal level questions to a state governor. We talk differently. We have an accent. And it's very hard for small businesses. Because their immigration started. Now, help. At the state level, one thing was common to all, education. Many of your needs are in common with families all over the Commonwealth from all kinds of backgrounds. You are concerned that the schools reach your children and that the quality of education for you is as high as it can be, just like other parents in every other community in the Commonwealth. In an event that was held at the prime of the U.S. federal census, the governor stressed on the need of all immigrants to rise and be counted. Everyone has not filled out the census. This is really important. He lashed out speculation that he is eyeing for the U.S. presidential seat in the near future. I get questions all the time and did through the last campaign and all the last four years. Are you on your way to Washington? I am proud that President Obama is our president. When he asked for people's votes, the answer was in accolade. Let me be absolutely clear. We need your help and I ask for your vote. You caught him. When it was evident that he could not stay no more, his security detail had to intervene to create a footpath in the woods for the man who seemed least bothered by the congestion that he helped create. Over 76,000 African immigrants are registered voters, though many are eligible but do not exercise the right in a state with a little over 4 million voters.